so LOA is the language of the river people in the show. Um, Rachel, do you want to tell us a little bit about that? Yeah. So it's a completely made up language that um, has some basis in some other kind of fictional languages and also some pre-existing ancient languages. And we're kind of using a mixture of of both of those background knowledges to combine <laughs> to make something <laughs> that has some semblance of some rules to follow. So the the fancy ancient languages that it kind of has basis in are like Proto-Celtic and Proto-Welsh and all these really <laughs> old um languages from that part of the world yeah. which I, what do you even call that britain <laughs> like i don't know I don't, I, that I, area yeah um My and they in in other fictional stories like lord of the rings um people have kind of used that language world and language group sound to create other fictional languages like J.R.R. Tolkien and the Elvish sounding. That's that's the one I was really excited about world. when you guys were talking about this. Is like, oh, we're yes. taking inspiration from Elvish. Um, Elvish. Which, which obviously makes a lot of sense because we're talking about like a culture in the show that's very in tune with the natural world. Right. That is like... I mean, again, the flowing of river, like kind of nature-y sounds, which I do think connects to Elvish, at least in my understanding yeah. of what Elvish is. <laughs> totally. I didn't not fall asleep during those movies, but I heard <laughs> some of it. Um, but no, yeah, like you're saying, like our overall goal was to create this like flowing, lilting language. Um, and so like in rehearsal, we are encouraging the actors to elongate all their vowels and play with pitch um, and different pronunciations of words that are kind of elongated and up and down and all that stuff to kind of, yeah, emulate the river and the wind and all these like natural elements. Um, and if you come see the show, you'll hear them talk a lot about how LOA is the language of their hearts. Yeah. Um, so it like is pretty emotion driven and um it's supposed to be beautiful because the things they're feeling and their souls that they're expressing are all this like, you know, a thing of beauty. So the language was built to reflect that. Yeah. So yeah.